Greetings, fellow knowledge seekers. Are you ready to embark on a linguistic expedition to Sangon's universities and uncover the multilingual mastery of Vietnamese students? Prepare to have your minds blow. First of all, can you introduce your names and how old are you? Hello everyone, my name is Zhang Tianyang and currently I am a sophomore at Foreign Trade University, Ho Chi Minh City campus. My name is Zhong and I'm 19 years old. Zhong, 19 years old. My name is Khánh Linh, you just call me Linh. My name is Sophia. How many languages can you speak? I can speak four languages. Vietnamese, which is my mother tongue, English, Japanese, and Korean a little bit. I think it's three, including Vietnamese, English, and Japanese. I can speak fluently in Vietnamese and English, mm -hmm. and a little bit of Japanese. English and Korean. Just choose um, Vietnamese and English. Japanese. I speak three languages, Vietnamese, English, and then I'm currently studying German. And what did you decide to learn languages? German is a compulsory language uh, that every student in my university, they, they have to learn. And actually I choose my university probably because I, I love learning languages. Because I like uh, their culture and uh, also my idol is BTS and I really uh, want to uh, someday we will meet them and uh, uh, talk to them, communicate well, my feeling to them. I really love the languages. I really love the sound when people speak and I love watching movies also. What's your favorite Korean band? I used to really love BTS. You still? You no longer <laughs> love them? Until now. <laughs> okay, until now. Okay. What language would you want to learn? Uh, I think it's Chinese. Chinese. Because it's popular and although it's hard to learn, but I think it is useful for my future. I also love Chinese movies. It's friends. It's in um, the most beautiful languages. English and Korean. Uh, I want to learn Spanish. Do you often listen to Latin music? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Can you say something in Japanese? Can you say anything in uh, Korean as Korean. well? 안녕하세요. 저는 링리입니다. 저는 베트남 사람입니다. 만나서 반갑습니다. Xin chào mọi người, mình đến từ trường Đại học Ngoại thương. Deutsch is eine schwierige Sprache, aber ich liebe es. Can you say I love you in the three languages that you can speak? Sao I love you. And Dylan, what did you feel when you grow up in the multilingual environment? So I came to Vietnam when I was nine years old. I back then I only speak Korean. So at first few years in Vietnam, it was very difficult for me because at class, I don't understand English nor Vietnamese, so I got a little bit bullied uh, from classmates because I didn't speak. But because I came here when I was a nine years old kid, I just like, it was really quickly for me to learn the language because, you know, we just be in the environment with people speaking Vietnamese and English of any purpose. Somehow I start, to, I start to speak the language because I was so immersed in the environment. And also I just want to talk and make friends. It was difficult, but not really if you surround yourself with people who speak that language. My advice is be open-minded. Don't afraid to try something new. And if you fail, it's okay. If it, things happen, it's really hard. Just be a little open-minded and be curious. Try to do something new. Say yes to new challenges and, you know, don't be afraid. You meet a lot of new people and amazing culture. And yeah, just try things out. After talking to all the people and students here, I'm so impressed. They can speak fluent English and they also other languages as well. So now, welcome to Vietnam. This is a very young and potential country for you. 